It is big, bold, and beautiful. This is a head so full of hair that it is officially certified. When it's straight, it goes all the way to her waist and has a circumference of nearly 1.5 meters. That's four feet, 10 inches of just flowing hair. Simone Williams is a proud owner of the largest female Afro on earth, according to Guinness World Records. For black women, I feel like natural hair symbolizes beauty, um, also acceptance. This is how our hair grows from our scalps. We don't need to manipulate it. And I feel like when our hair is natural, we're, it's the truest form of ourself. Hair like this attracts attention wherever she goes, especially in a world full of bald people like me. Please don't ever touch my hair. Don't walk up to me to touch my hair. Um, the polite thing to do is ask. I'll most likely say no, but I appreciate people asking. The Afro has been such a political tool for resistance in the civil rights movement here, in Africa against colonialism. So do you feel like with great hair comes great responsibility? Absolutely. <laughs> it's a task in itself just to maintain it. So it's, it's a huge responsibility for me. And do you take that responsibility seriously? Definitely, like, <laughs> very seriously. <laughs> Simone wore her hair natural when she was growing up, but started straightening it or getting perms in middle school. It's only after she graduated college almost 10 years ago that she went back to its original form. The 32-year-old fashion designer also works in finance, where some might not consider her Afro professional enough. Professionalism for me doesn't come from hair. It comes from what you know, your knowledge, basically what's inside your head, not what's on it. Since breaking the world record with her Afro, people from as far as Cuba and Zimbabwe have contacted Simone to say she inspired them. My hair is so important to me because it holds a lot of my heritage. Um, it's a way for me to connect with my ancestors, just being a black woman and knowing that people before me have worn their hair like this as such a symbol of pride. Like, it means so much to me. Simone says her hair care routine is simpler than you might think, and it only takes her a few minutes to get ready. I can relate. It's a little unfair that you have all that hair and I have none of it at all. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, have patience. <laughs>